let's check out how to do a baseline without having to reset all your pupil accounts. Your first option would be to use our worksheets, which are found here. Just choose your class to begin. Each pack of worksheets begins with a baseline and that takes about five minutes to complete. You can use this to get a measure of where your pupils are at right now. It's a really good option if you want to do a baseline in class and it's especially useful if you've got limited access to internet enabled devices. The scores for the baseline are all out of 60 and you can enter the scores by clicking here. As you progress through the year, you can complete the check one and check two worksheets as well. So you can literally see the progress your pupils have made. Okay, so now let's look at options for an online version of a baseline. For this, we're gonna use gigs. Let's check it out on the pupil site first. So here I'm logged in as a pupil and if I click on single player, I can see the gig game. Gigs have a hundred multiplication questions. They start with 10 questions on the tens, followed by 10 questions on each of the twos, fives, threes, fours, eights, sixes, and sevens, and nines. And then five questions finally on the elevens and twelves. Pupils have five minutes to answer as many questions correctly as they can, and their score is always out of 100. The quicker they answer, the more points out of 100 they can score. The fantastic thing about gigs is that as well as providing you with baseline data, which we'll look at in a second, they also feed our smart algorithm. If we go and play in the garage game mode, the facts that our algorithm will pick for the pupils to practice, those are the ones which we've highlighted in purple, they have been partially based on the recall speed of those facts during the gig. So let's flip back to the teacher site. We click stats and choose our class and then gig. Here are all our pupils and their first and latest gig results. You can see just how much they've improved here. Gigs are automatically enabled for pupils to complete once a month, but if you want all pupils to do them together, just select all pupils, then click this enable on next login button. This way you could get all pupils to complete the gig in a class and use the results as your baseline. And that's it. That's how to set a baseline using either worksheets or our gig mode. If you want more info on either of these tools, just check out our help center and search for gig or worksheets for tips and how-to guides.